These studies from the late 1980s, comparing all four surfaces used by Corvent, shows that by two months, HA-coated screw vent implants doubled the attachment strength as measured by torque removal. By the early 1990s, SBM replaced acid etch and TPS surfaces on Corvent implants. The same SBM surface is being used today by Implant Direct, BioHorizons, and Zimmer Biomet. Zimmer Biomet is promoting the trabecular metal surface screw vent as a premium price with a trabecular metal insert in its midsection. This eliminates about two thirds of the thread engagement and provides a porous surface that could become a hygiene problem if exposed from bone loss. Initially, Zimmer had an FDA recall on this implant requiring that it change the surgical protocol in dense bone to eliminate thread engagement by the apical threads of the implant. When the apical threads engage bone, the threaded part below the trabecular metal was separating from the implant. The reason was that they slip this trabecular metal on the implant core and then weld the bottom threaded portion. Using step drills, this apical threaded portion would engage dense bone and break off as the implant continued to be turned. From this x-ray, it appears that the implant has been changed from tapered to straight, giving up on the advantages of bone compression from inserting a tapered implant into an undersized socket.